Hello all yours and people out there, my name is Akira and welcome back to this let's play of Pokemon Black Nuzlocke Where there's a lot of people over here, so I think that is important. So <laughs> Wow, story starts out fast here Takira come here a sec Oh, we need a voice for him now. Okay, so my name is. Oh, I don't have a voice for him right now. Let's see. Gertzis. Gertzis. I have no idea how to pronounce that. Anyways, I will. I will. I will try, and I'll probably screw it up and get <sighs> corrected by someone in the comments. <laughs> My name is Gertzis. I am here. Representing Team Plasma. Today, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to talk to you about Pokemon Liberation. I'm sure most of you believe that we human and Pokemon are partners that have come to live together because we want and we need each other. However, is that really the truth? Have you ever considered that perhaps we humans only assume that this is the truth? Pokemon are subject to selfish commands of trainers. They get pushed around when they are our partners at work. Can anyone say with confidence that there is no truth in that what I'm saying? Now, ladies and gentlemen, Pokemon are different from humans. They are living beings that contain unknown potential. They are living beings from whom we humans have much to learn. Tell me, what is your responsibility towards those wonderful beings called Pokemon? That's right, we must liberate the Pokemon. Then. And only then will humans and Pokemon truly be equals. Everyone, I am, I, I end my words here today by implying you to consider the relationship between people and Pokemon, and the correct way to proceed. We sincerely appreciated your attention. Okay. <laughs> About that speech, what do you think we should do? Liberate Pokemon? That's not even... That's not even possible. Your Pokemon. Just now, it was saying... <laughs> Slow down! You talk too fast! And what's this about Pokemon talking? That's an odd thing to say. Yes, they're, they're talking. Oh, <laughs> then you two can't hear it either? How sad. My name is N. My name is Jaren. And this is Takira. We have asked to, <laughs> we were asked to complete the Pokedex, and we just left to our journey. My main goal is to become a champion, though. The Pokedex, huh? So you're going to confirm, <laughs> so you're going to confine many, many Pokemon in Pokeballs for that? Then I'm a trainer too, but I can't help wondering. Are Pokemon really happy that way? Well, Takira, is it? Let me hear your Pokemon's voices again. Okay, you're challenged by Pokemon Trainer N. This can only go wrong. <laughs> so he has a Porygon, and I have this one. And I get, didn't get to um, train a little. I didn't get around to grind a little before this episode, so hopefully I can do this. 
And I screwed up totally. But I should be stronger than him. Mole! Let me hear the voices of the Pokemon! You're scratching me! That didn't hurt at all. And the last one. Uh, Jack is taking it fine. <laughs> Don't want to lose anything here. I never experienced. <laughs> I didn't get to read that. God dang it. As long as Pokemon are confined in Pokeballs, Pokemon will never become perfect beings. I have to change the world for Pokemon because they're my friends. Well, okay. Uh, bye bye. Huh? Strange guy. But I'm not going to worry about it. Trainers and Pokemon help each other out. Listen, I'm going on ahead. I want to battle a gym, the gym leader in the next town. Strachian, <laughs> Strachian City. Aim to battle gym leaders after gym leader. And. <laughs> The best way for a trainer to become stronger is to challenge the gym leaders in each area. Oop. And now I'm alone again. So yeah, before the story part, I was about to um, <laughs> say something, I think. Uh, I can't remember now, but um, yeah. As you all may know, I have a Christian of the day. Oh, actually a Christian of the video. And I got some answers on that one, so... You can on screen right now see the answers that I got. And thank you all you have that have answered the question. And for the next week, I think the question will be who is your favorite gym leader in the Pokemon series? So there's a lot to choose from. Um, personally, my favorite is um, Flannery uh, from Pokemon Ruby Sapphire, Omega Ruby, and Alpha Sapphire games. So. But, um, ooh, I can see things over there. So, but, um, yeah, I want to know what um, your favorite are. You can leave the comments down below in the description. As always, just um, make sure to um, tag um, it with the QOTV. Um, so I know that is the question of the day you're answering. Oh, right. I totally forgot how those works. I really love that they play the music to match the background sound action in the game. That's kind of a good atmosphere to give. So... But yeah, also if you have something that you want to know, um, you can also leave a um, question down below in the description for me to answer in the next episode of um, Pokemon. And I will look into it. Um, of course, I can't say for sure if I will get around to answer all questions that I get. Because there can be many questions in comparison to how much time it will take to answer them. But I would love if you do because sometimes I have nothing to talk about when I play these games. And I want to get them on a personal level with you guys when I play games. It's more fun that way when I can talk to you about stuff. And yeah, I'm just <laughs> right now running around and talk to people. I'll not read what they say because that will take too long. Um, I'll just see if I can find important stuff. Like something in the trash cans? Nope. Okay. People are really good at um, entering the trash cans for some reason. Um, but yeah. If you have any suggestions for anything, then um, just say it. Also, if you have some um, names you want me to give to Pokemon, then um, also please um, write them in the comments down below because. Maybe I will choose some of your names, um, ideas for names, because sometimes I'm really bad at coming up with nicknames. Even though I like to give names to things, sometimes it can actually be quite hard to come up with things. Oh, right, it's not X and Y. I can't sit on the bench. <laughs> Sad face. <laughs> I don't know. Also, last time I realized that... Um, <laughs> actually, I saw it when I was rendering. Uh, when I got the call from the professor, I was actually watching the one person when they talked. I realized that was a little um, speaker icon on the picture of who was talking. So, actually it was um, Bianca that was talking all the time <laughs> when I thought it was um, 
Or Charon. Ooh, a Pokeball, thank you. So, yeah, I know I can catch Pokemon and Pokeballs. So, but yeah, I, I, I kind of screw up there, so... Sorry about that, but I, I didn't notice before, so... I hope that I can do better this time and look out for that little icon. Hey, let's play Pokemon Rock, Paper, Scissors. Okay, here goes Pokemon Rock, Paper, Scissors, Grass! Okay, didn't I get anything out of that? Oh, I think it's just a learning time thing when I learn what weeks against things, so nothing important there. Well, out of the house again. But um, I would be more curious, uh, not curious, um, con conscious about um, who is saying what and stuff, so. But uh, let's get to the next road. So, what I know of, I may catch a Pokemon here. Oh, I can take my phone! <laughs> Takira pick up the Extravia. Oh, it's my man! I see there's the little icon I was talking about. Uh, I didn't see that last time at all, I don't know what the hell I was doing. Takira! <laughs> what the fuck was that voice? It's your mom! How are things? Are you and your Pokemon getting along and enjoying your journey so far? I needed to talk to you, so I called, but I'm going to hang up. Take three. <laughs> the extra is now. Okay. Oh! Takira! I finally caught up with you. <laughs> and look how far you even. you come already. Professor Juniper said that you were probably headed to Stravian. Stravian City. I have no idea how to pronounce that. What? STR stays. <laughs> E A say yeah, T O N say ton, E I on, Australian, Australian city. By now, I have another present for you, Takira. Try this on. Takira received a pair of running shoes. Yay! I can run now. I've missed it. When you are wearing the running shoes, you can go anywhere in a flash. Let me read the instructions. Hold the B button <laughs> to run faster than normal. Put on the running shoes and tear and tear around on your heart's contain. That's what it says. I brought these a long time ago and stayed them away somehow. I found them when I was cleaning up. Guess it's good to clean occasionally. Takira, you understand that you're never really alone, right? You with your Pokemon, you have friends, and you're always in my thoughts. That's all right then. Enjoy your trip. I have running shoes, so. The B button. What button is? Oh, that's the B button. I can run. I can hide. I can sing. I cannot do that one. Okay. Route two. Are you a trainer? Battles between Pokemon and Pokemon. Okay. So let's see what we meet here. Okay, this is a duplicate, so I may not catch this one. Um, I know it's an. <laughs> My first Pokemon, but I was shaken up in the rules and I may not catch duplicates of Pokemon, so I can just kill it and try the next one. So... Please, um... Go down. There we go. And let's see if I can find something else that is not a pet rat. And I got another potion. Yay! I love potions. So, Pokemon, where are you? I want to catch you. <laughs> oh, so we have a uh, Perlon. Perlon. I have no idea how to pronounce that name. Something you would learn about me when I play this name. I have no idea how to pronounce things. So, but um, let's see. Hopefully, it's level 5, so it should be able to survive a water gun. If it's not a critical hit, of course, and it wasn't. So let's see if we can get ourselves a Porygon. Come on, come on, come on. Nope. I will try once more because it looks like it should be able to stay in the ball. One more try. 
That is the only thing that's been like. Oh god, stop that! I want to catch you. And if this keeps on, I have to use a potion instead. <laughs> Not to die. <laughs> It'll be stupid if I try to catch a Pokemon, then I lose a Pokemon in the process. That. What the F? Okay, I have to use a potion instead then. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I'm not that afraid of your growling. Um, my attack failed. Oops, not what I wanted. Uh, maybe it fell enough to I can use a tackle, because tackle is not that strong. That was close. But um, now I should be able to catch it. I hope. Back. Pokeballs. This has cost me way too many Pokeballs. There we go. Okay. Pure Lens data was added to the Pokedex. Thank you. They steal from people for fun, but their victims can't help but forgiving them. They are descriptively cute <laughs> at this, as perfect. Is perfect. Oh. So give a nickname to this Perlon. Okay, so this Perlon will be named Actually it will be named after the cat we have in the house. So yeah, it will be called Batman. Um, yeah, we have a cat. Um, my roomie's where I live with has a cat, and the name of the cat is Batman. So this cat will also be named Batman. And yeah, I think I will continue because I have a lot of health now because I've healed before it got to here. So, but it's really been thinking about them actually <laughs> grinding a little because I'm not as strong. I just realized. So hopefully this will go okay. Uh, the problem is actually not, uh, my main cat Pokemon here is almost level 10, so that's strong enough, but it's more like the other on my team is like level 5 and level 3, I think. Oh, and we forgot to check Pokemon, so status. I will do that in a second. After I knocked out this little guy. And Jack grows a level, so let's see. Um, Pokemon. Batman Summary. Okay, it has a quickly nature, which means that it should have... I have no idea. It has a quirky, oh sorry, not quickly, a quirky. Which seems to give nothing in anything, so... Uh, its ability is limber, the Pokemon is protected from paralysis, that's kind of nice. And it has grass and growl, nothing else to it. Whoops. So it's okay, but I have to heal it. So my next goal will be take on that trainer and probably go back to the Pokemon Center and heal up a little. And then try to get to the next city. So I'm attacked by youngster Jimmy. And he has a pet rat. Oh god, level 7. I really have to grind some levels or right, this will go south in some way soon. <laughs> So I should probably put in some switch training soon. Maybe I will go to... I, th I think my goal for this let's play, maybe it will not be that long an episode, but I think my goal would be to get to... Uh, what is called the next city, and from there I will probably... Okay, so you call that amazing? Okay, why don't you use? So, but yeah, my goal will probably be to get to the next city and uh, from there I will probably stop this episode and then put in some grinding and then the next episode will continue the story. So now we have a goal, so let's um, continue this adventure. And also, as I said, I will put in some switch training, so I will take and switch out this and this. 
because switch training is the most easiest way to actually level up your Pokemon um, in this um, generation. Because what I know of is this generation, if I get the XP share, it still works the old way the XP share worked with them. Um, only the Pokemon that has it attached will get them um, XP. Where in the later games, informant, the XP share is like the most overpowered thing in the whole game. <laughs> so. Yeah, you will not fight. You will um, switch out. Go, Jack! Oh, I actually wanted a lily pup. It's so cute when it evolves. But okay, I would say Perlin also has a really awesome evol uh, evolution. Uh, evolvement. <laughs> evolution. <laughs> so, uh, I'm okay with that. And there we go. So let's continue. There's another youngster that probably wants to f not fight me. When your Pokemon does have enough. <laughs> that how are we think? <laughs> Trainer tips. Yeah, I know that. And we have a lass. I think that's a lass. I really love Pokemon battles because my cute Pokemon will do its best in, in a really cute way. Okay. <laughs> that reminds me. Of one of my friends um, only uh, he was collecting a Pokemon card, but he only collected the Pokemon cards with two Pokemon on. That was that was funny, <laughs> and he thought, and he was wondering why he always was losing um, Pokemon battles when we were playing the card game. But yeah, probably because he only had two Pokemon, and they were not really strong because both of two Pokemon were like baby Pokemon of first stage evolutions, so <laughs> he didn't have that good a deck. But well. That's how it is sometimes with people. Let me water gun you a little. Yeah, your assist doesn't work. Because... Well, I don't know if the trainer only had one Pokemon, so assist doesn't work at all. Because assist takes... Well, I don't know if a move from another Pokemon in, in your team and uses that. So yeah, that was kind of stupid for you to use that attack on me. So I can't get up there, so let's go... I'm going in the tall grass because I want to gain some levels. And I found a Pokeball. Uh, a potion. And a Pokeball. Well, I was right about finding a Pokeball then. And let's see if that youngster wants to fight me also because I want to fight things. Pet rats! Go, Timon! Timon. <laughs> Timon! Um, I will switch out again because switch training and stuff. Uh, I really don't hope I meet my rivals up ahead because <sighs> then I will be screwed with the levels, I think. But hey, that's that's how it is sometimes. So let's see. Do you want to fight me, little pup, little pup, my little pup? Go! I have a feeling that he has a little pup, lily pup. I don't know why. It would have been fun if you played this as a randomizer and you didn't have one, so... But, yeah, I will not play a randomizer because... It has been so long, so I can't remember everything in this game anyways. So, I think it's fair that I just play it as a normal... That, um, as, only as a Nuzlocke. Not like... I've seen some play um, randomizers and they can get kind of screwy. And then there's some that plays um, something called Ultimate Randomizer and that's really... Like, holy fuck, because not only does the Pokemon in the areas change and the Pokemon trainers have, uh, but also what typing they are and the moveset they can learn and stuff like that has changed, so... I can't imagine how hard that will be to play, so... I'll just play it as normal here, or else I will be really screwed, I think. Because <laughs> I love playing Pokemon, but don't get me wrong there, but I'm not that good at remembering stuff like <laughs> typing and stuff. So, oh, it evolved and learned new attacks. Yay! Bye bye. So, if I go this way, I would just have to jump off. This way, I can't go. Route two. Oh, I was right. Takira, come on, Takira. 
How did you come from there? <laughs> hey, listen! Let's have a Pokemon battle. No, I don't want. Please! The Pokemon I caught have become a little stronger. Ready and that, here I come! I don't want a Pokemon battle. <laughs> well, I have to defeat you then. Oh, I can do that. Okay, so... Okay, I'm level 6, so I should be good to go with fighting, so let's fight it. As long as... I think Lear is taking my... Oh, it's my defense. I have to really... What for normal Pokemon are going to... I can't get to read that. So it's taking my defense. I have to watch out for that. And it identified me. I actually have no idea what identified does. But um, apparently I don't hit that hard. And I have to get it down now. Nope. 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 Like, nope. Um, Pokemon switch to Jack. Because... The team 1 will die if I keep it out. And I don't want to lose any Pokemon here. That will be kind of stupid of me. Water spot. I have no idea what water spot does actually. Water spot. I don't know. I, I, I will take that up in a moment. Yeah, you can take my defense, but you will never take anything else. And I will tag you for the rest. <laughs> so, first up, done. And then she has the Turpig, and the Turpig should be fairly easy to defeat for me. Because I'm a water Pokemon and that's fire, so it, it really don't stand a chance. <laughs> yeah, you're in trouble. I'll just do that because you can still use a potion, so better safe than sorry. <laughs> and I defeated Bianca. Oh, I couldn't win. <laughs> well. You are a tough cookie, Chakira. I'm gonna work hard on training my Pokemon, so we won't lose them anymore. Okay, bye bye. Okay. Well, that went well. Let's see. There's a thing there. X speed. I really never use those items actually. I kind of always sell them. So let's see what we can find here. First off, I should be looking for Pokemon Center maybe, but what else? And, ooh, a Great Ball. Thank you. I can use that. I know what a Great Ball does, so... Why is it with people in all the clean trash cans? Let's see, what do we have up here? A lot of kits. I'm wondering where people actually are sleeping. I can't seem to find a bed. And yeah, I have given all my Pokemon nicknames. I want to check your trash can. It's empty. <laughs> Why isn't there any beds in this house? That's weird. Where are people sleeping? On the floor? Well, okay, Japanese people, so... No, not to offend them, but... Um, what I've noticed is that most... For some reason... Most Japanese people sleep not in beds, but in... Um, futons on the floor. Okay, so... Um, what, what was it? You can't go upstairs now. Because Fennel... Fennel said he was testing something and she had a scary look on her face. I will not comment on that. So let's just talk to everyone in the city real quick. Oh, a Pokemon Center. I think I will um, go and heal my Pokemon. Yeah, I know how the boxes works, and yeah, you didn't have anything else. Please heal up my Pokemon, thank you. Okay, so we try this again. Please heal up my Pokemon, thank you. <laughs> I don't know what I touched on the controls, but I think I pressed the B button. Nope. 
My Pokemon are healed. I don't want to heal them again. So, let's see. Nothing here. Isn't there any way to get into that house? This house? Hmm. Weird house. Weird man. They say in Sith Gym, no matter how often I challenge him, he always uses Pokemon that I don't like. Is this the... Is this the gym? No, this is the training school. Let's see. If we can find anything of interest in here. Yeah, no Pokemon has special abilities and stuff like that. Mm. Which of the following item cures po uh, poison? An antidote. Now for the next question. What item uh, what item that cures paralyze is paralyzed you, but which of the falling item wakes a sleeping Pokemon, it's awakening. Thank you, I got a full heal. That is useful. When a Pokemon is poisoned, its HP decreases while it's battling. Hey Takira! Have you come looking for the gym leader? He was here talking about Pokemon types until just a few moments ago. Maybe you walked right past him. By the way, Takira, will you have a battle with me? I want to test how important items are in battle. Let's see how fixed my items are. Or maybe I should test how well I can battle without items. Anyways, this is an indoor match, so let's battle without getting too rough. <laughs> no, I will hit you into next day. Oh god. <laughs> I don't think I'm prepared for this battle though, <laughs> but I will try my best. So, Snivy versus Timon. I have a feeling I might underseed it here. Yeah, but I will try my best to survive. Just to see how hard you're hitting me. Okay, I can take some hits from you. Leo should lower my attack. No, not defense. I have to keep an eye out for that because that can screw me over if I don't. What's out? Did you give in on Chester Berry? Or oh, Orange Berry? Oh god. I hate berries. Ow. Okay, I have to. God. This one is going to get screwy, I think. Hope Snivy isn't that hard against them. <laughs> I only have my water type Pokemon. <laughs> At least it used Tackle. Tackle doesn't do that much damage. I know Water Gun is not that effective, but... Uh, I don't like that. How much damage will my Tackle do? A lot more. God damn. Good, good. Oh, and it was critical attack. Phew. Then I should be okay for now. Do you have a problem too? Oh, how cute is that? I have to kill it fast though. Oh, not kill it. Knock out it. Well, okay, critical hit. <laughs> that was fast. I see. Losing to you means that I still have a lot to learn. I said in not challenge voice at all. So learning to use items well is definitely important then. <laughs> oh, here's a cure, I'll give you these berries. Thank you. If you give a Pokemon this kind of berry to hold, it will eat it to heal up when its HP goes down in battle. But if you give Pokemon man made items like potions to heal, they can't use them. Well, good luck then. Okay, so Whew. I was really afraid that I would lose this battle. Mm, let's see if we can find anything else.
<laughs> music. <laughs> I have a tendency to kind of sing along with the music when I hear things, so sorry about that. But um, let's see. I can't get to the trash cran. You are standing in the way. And nothing of important here. So let's get out again. Yeah, I did talk to him also. I couldn't remember if I had talked to him, but this is this is kind of out of the city. And I don't think that's uh, what I have to do. Okay, and that is the Pokemon Gym Leader. One of them. And I know this place is going for not of area. Where I will go later because there's some story related there, I I remember correctly. Something about a Pokemon with flower off uh, patterns. But I will just heal up first. So I know that I have to go to the gym now, but I also know that the gym will take take Pokemon that are difficult for me to beat. So I think I will grind before next time and get stronger. I can grind a lot now, but it's not fun to watch a grinding. So if people want me to make a grinding montage in the start of the next video, please tell me so. And yeah, if not, um, then don't tell me so. Uh, but else I will end this episode for today. So, and then I will grind till the next episode. As a, and as I said, if you want to see the grinding montage, I will record it and put it in the start of the video. So, but it's up to you if you want me to put it in or not. So, yeah. And then I will take on the gym next time. Triple trouble. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Um, with that, um, I will end this. So, uh, please, as I said, answer the question of the video. Um, tag it QOTV. You can also leave suggestions what I should talk about, and you can leave suggestions for names to give to my Pokemon. And with that, I hope you enjoyed this video. You can give it a thumb up if you did. You can hit me up on Facebook or Twitter or write a comment down below. You can subscribe for more awesome videos, and I hope you all would have an awesome day. So, until next time, farewell. Mm -hmm.